Time I come out here and touch with them electric guitars, you get the shot. That's real fun. I came in here. I gotta tell you a story. Don't touch with that thing. I get All electrocuted. Right. Tell me, tell you a story. I came in a little while ago, and the director said to me, "I said, look, it. Sleepy's been there rehearsing since eight o'clock tonight. He's played 800 songs in a row and hasn't played the same Good song twice." Like yeah, you. Now you know. People say you when you go out to do a gig, you have about five or six thousand tunes that you gotta decide what you're gonna play on any given night. No, I don't. But we don't rehearse. You can tell that the way we sound. We don't rehearse. But I mean, you got about five thousand songs in your head that you can play in any moment. Well, I don't know for sure how many, but we we've got enough. Got a few been playing these rockabilly for a couple years now. Uh, since 1955. Sound like you sound like yeah. you got it down. Yeah. yeah, we we do all the good rockabilly tunes that uh, all the way back to the 
Buddy Holly, the Jerry Lee, Chuck Berry, Fats Domino, Little Richard, all, all the good ones. Well, you recorded on, on, on Sun Records, which is... Well, the... I was with uh, Pappy Daly out of Houston first. Whoa, <laughs> that touch that's me. nasty. <laughs> that thing is nasty. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, with uh, Star Day Records, we started in Houston, Texas, and uh, we cut our first record in about 56. From Star Day, we went to... Uh, Mercury, Mercury to Columbia Records in Nashville, Tennessee, and Columbia to Sun Records. The original rock and roll label was Sun Records. And from Sun Records to Rounder now. Oh, you're on Rounder yeah. Records these days? Yes, yeah, that's right. They like having you in there. be there. It's a good company. Now you, uh, you live down, you're back in Arkansas now. You're back in, uh, you live near your hometown, do you? Yes, uh, near Smackover, a little town called Lawson. That's right out of El Dorado and Smackover, out in the country. It's about 12 uh, miles out, we have some pigs and some goats and all this stuff out there. The lack, lack, was it Lackover? Lack. Lawson. Lawson is the, is the, the yeah. gateway to the Smackover. That's how people know it. Well, you can go that way, but it's a little out of the way to go by Lawson into Smackover. But you can get there. What kind of a town is Smackover? It sounds like... Population of about, probably about uh, 3,500. When you were a little boy, I was reading that you didn't, you didn't even have a light in your house. You just kind of a log cabin. Yes, we had to watch television by Colo. By <laughs> <laughs> yes, that is kind of tough. Did you get to meet uh, Elvis? You play with him? Or? Yes, yes, I did. I didn't play with him, no. But we were on some of the same shows uh, back in Houston, Houston Jamboree, Magnolia Gardens, uh, Grand Prize Jamboree, things like that in Houston. I know you came. Also, with Louisiana Hayride. The same kind of roots as Elvis, uh, gospel music, that kind of yes, thing. Yes, that's what I began on. You ever think of going back and oh, singing yes. in the church yes, again? Yes, it's uh, probably the best music there is. The Lord's music. Yes, right. And what are you gonna play for us now? A little more rock uh, belly? Well. Uh, I really didn't have anything in mind. What we want? Let's do one we recorded here a while back. Um, let's do Hello, Josephine. How about that? Hello, Hello. Josephine. Yeah. Sleep with the beat. All right. Hello, What do you think, you know, we've been all night, we've been talking about all the fashions here in Boston. You, as a true, uh, a, well, an Ar a Texan uh, via Arkansas, you must think it's all pretty funny, all these city slickers trying to wear these clothes. No. I, I noticed you snickering. I think it's all right, really. Uh, I think you should dress the way you want to. And today, the trend seems to be cowboy clothes. If you feel good and you can boogie-woogie and dance in them or whatever, that's okay. You've been doing this for, now you've been playing this rock and music for, G, 20, uh, 25, yeah, at least 25 plus. Since it started, yes. Now, how, I mean, well, you've seen all, it all. You've seen it all come and go, the Beatles and, you know, that hard rock and this and that. Does it all seem the same to you after all Who? this time? The Beatles. Well, uh, yes. Uh, i tell you, I think the original rock and roll or rockabilly is what I prefer to do. And there's many other music that's good, but that's not uh, what I want to do. 
I want to do the things that's relative to country and the original rock and roll. When you're driving in your uh, in your mobile home up the highway and you got your tape deck playing, what kind of stuff do you listen to? Well, I play rockabilly sometimes, uh, sometimes Sister Rosetta Thorpe on the old gospel uh, rhythm and blues type stuff, and sometimes Hank Williams, uh, sometimes uh, Little Richard. It don't make any difference. I, I don't listen to just rockabilly. But that's what you play. Oh uh, yeah, but I do country music, blues, uh, gospel, whatever. Did you did you have an idea? Last time we asked you what you're gonna play next, you weren't sure. You got an idea of what you want to do for us now? Yeah, I know you got our audience in the studio really warmed up. I mean, I don't think I'd want to play a ballad right now. It's, you can't play ballads on this show. It's too late. They just go right to sleep. I don't know. Why don't we? Why don't we do one? Uh, one ballad, okay? Yeah, sure. <laughs> is okay. <it laughs> sure, this is gonna be this is a ballad, Sleep of the Beef style. This is Sleep of the Beef's idea of a ballad. All right, all right here we go. Sleep of the Beef, everybody. Excuse me. With my darling to the Tennessee wall, what an old friend I happened to see. I introduced him to my darling, and while they were dancing, my friend stole my sweetheart from me. Saturday night, I got married. Uh, me and my wife settled down. Now, uh, me and my wife are parted. I'm gonna take another stroll downtown. Will I? Hello. If you see 